Hi everyone, thanks for joining me. I'm Betsy with Easy Peasy, and today I'm gonna to be talking to you about tips to help you clean faster. Cleaning takes forever. I hate it because it takes so long, so these are my tips to help you do it quickly and hopefully not dread it as much. So here's our tips for cleaning faster. I have my baby with me. I'm gonna be feeding him as we talk, and here we go. I have had three kids in the last four years, and so I have become very efficient in cleaning. Um, anything I could do to minimize the amount of time it takes me to clean something, I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna share with you what has helped me to clean very quickly. One tip is to do the cleaning frequently. So I'll give the example of bathrooms in this video. So we have two bathrooms in our house, if I clean them once a week, then it is way faster cleaning every time I clean than it is if I wait a whole month and it takes me an hour or an hour and a half to clean the bathroom because it's so gross. Um, so if I do it once a week, I can get it done in 15 minutes and it will reduce the time because there's less to clean because you just did it five days ago, seven days ago, whatever your schedule is that you set up for yourself tip I have for you is to keep all the cleaning supplies you need for that cleaning project near where you're going to be. So if you have all your cleaning supplies you need for cleaning the bathroom in the bathroom, it reduces the time of going and finding them from another room in the house. Now I know some people keep all their cleaning supplies in their laundry room or something like that. I have found if I have the cleaning supplies in the room where I'm cleaning, it does cut down on time. First of all, because I know exactly where they are. Um, it can also help with having kids clean or, um, you know, when I was postpartum, I would have a mother-in-law or a mom come and say, you know, somebody say, oh, can I help you with something? And I could say, yeah, today's Tuesday. I clean bathrooms on Tuesday. Everything you need is in the cabinet. At first, it does seem like a little bit of an investment because I have, you know, two adult, two pack of toilet bowl cleaner that I bought instead of just a single one but you're using the same amount. So although you're buying two initially to put in two different bathrooms, you're gonna be using them slower because it's only for that bathroom. So um, you're still using the same amount, so you're not spending any more in the long run. It is a little bit more, but I have found, you know, you can get a toilet brush from the Dollar Tree. You can get a little broom, a little handheld broom and a dustpan from the Dollar Tree. And I really like that when my husband is home from work, and we it's it's thursday and we do the kitchen on thursday again everything you need to clean the kitchen is in the box under the counter another tip for cleaning quickly and this is my favorite one is to always do it in the same order so have a routine of how you clean that space um so i'll give you a bathroom as my example i started always doing it in the same way so first i put the toilet bowl cleaner in let it sit then I take anything out. We have a step stool for the kids. We have the trash can on the floor and the toilet paper thing. I move all those things off the floor, clear off the counter. Then I wash the sink, wash the counter, wash all the surfaces. Then I sweep and take out the trash. After that, I clean the toilet. And then last, I mop. And so because this is how our brain works, if we always do it in the same order, it's less time it takes to think about it and less mental energy you're using so that you don't feel as tired. Um, and it also takes less time because it's part, it's become a routine. So I think of it as, you know, whenever you get in the car to drive, you sometimes back up and look in your mirror, put on your seatbelt. You do all these things without even thinking because it's so common and so routine. So I do this for cleaning the kitchen every night after dinner. I always do it in the same way um, because I'm getting faster at it when I'm doing it in the same way and it doesn't feel as tiring because I'm not using as much mental energy. Another tip is to clean in your best time of day. So when you have energy, when you're not exhausted, now you may say I'm exhausted all day and I get that. <laughs> but for me, cleaning in the morning is way easier by the time it gets to afternoon by the time definitely gets to evening after dinner i'm gonna skip it i'm not gonna do it i can tell you right now i do not mop my floors at night you would think it makes sense to sweep and mop after dinner i can't do it then i do it in the afternoon during nap time none of the kids are on the floor so i have it 
I have it cleared and I can do it with nobody in that room. Um, but also if I wait until night, it won't happen because I'm tired. So you're going to have the most energy and you're going to do it faster if you choose a time of day where you have the most energy and you're the most awake. So that tip, and that's one of my favorites also, is to choose the best time of day that works for you because you will clean faster when you have energy and you are motivated. Bonus tip, bonus tip is to set a timer. It may sound a little silly, but you will work harder and faster if you have a timer set. Um, it works really well for me. I usually pick 15 minutes because I like to get a lot done and 15 minutes sounds like a good time. 30 minutes is usually too long in between making meals or taking care of baby or whatever. 15 minutes is just right and I can get a lot done in 15 minutes. Set the timer, you uh, will get distracted less, I promise. Um, you will find yourself not looking at your phone as often and then you have more time after those 15 minutes to do fun stuff and enjoy your life instead of cleaning so much. It's always a hassle and I don't know anyone who says, oh, I love spending the entire day cleaning. No, I love the accomplishment. I love the clean house. I love how that feels, but I don't enjoy how long it takes cleaning. So I hope these tips have helped. Be sure to like, share, subscribe if you're interested and let me know what other videos you'd like to hear me share with you about easy peasy ways to do things for you and your kids. Have a great day. Bye.